Hello everyone. We have previously seen how to path arguments uh, in function calls. Like when we call function, uh, we can pass in arbitrary number of arguments and we can pack them into a tuple in the function definition. So today let us practice uh, through some examples. So we will uh, compute the minimum of my passed in a set of values, arbitrary number of values you can pass in and we will compute the minimum of that uh, passed in values and um, we'll see let's see how to we can how we can call it so let's call our function maybe my min right and uh, i'm going to say maybe one first one uh, we can say star k right arbitrary number of elements and then if i say maybe we can say k or you know k is a standard thing we use right so we can say f equal to uh, or Maybe starting value maybe start equal to k zero and then if I say for item in k one rest of the item so what we have to do is simply if right uh, if item right less than start we have to just say start equal to item right so whenever if it is less than item is uh, less than we have to uh, put the lowest value in start so we'll keep on making the start the lowest value in each comparison and we can return back start so let's see if it is working so my min one right i can pass maybe 100 200 1 3 30. So it is working. So let us record in some other way. For example, we can, for example, say uh, the uh, maybe the first right and star k. Okay. So we collect the first item whichever we passing in first, and the rest will go to k as a tuple. And here we don't have to do this line. And we say now we can use uh, first right if item less than first i can say first equal to id and return first right nothing same idea so instead of uh instead of uh instead of uh, we pass the first item whichever we're passing is in the first and rest in the k and we now we have to go through the whole k no i can't i don't have to index like one from and then we do the same logic of uh, keeping the lowest value in the first and say my min uh anyway i think we lost it but let's call this as two my min two i can say 300 one two So this is also working. So let us call maybe we can use um, list, right? So let us do everything same. So I can say maybe say um, k. I can overwrite k as list of k, and I can say k dot sort and return uh, k zero, right? The first value will sort it and save the first value in the list the first value will be the minimum so my main two anyway i overwrote it so so let's for so let's call it so that you know we have three i'm just calling anyway i overwrote it we can go back and put it if you want it so my main three i can say so it is finding so we have like different ways the idea is mainly to illustrate the minimum uh the how to how we can use the arbitrary number of arguments so if we can you know it doesn't matter five right i can have another one two thousand one you know uh, one point five point point one arbitrary number of items here right 
So this is the idea. And since Python object compares also strings, you can also pass in a number of in a strings and compare them too. Uh, so now, uh, let us, for example, call one function which will uh, do both minimum and maximum. So we'll pass some kind of a tester function which does uh, less than or greater than comparison. So what I'm saying is, so uh, let's do say less function which is simply a lambda uh, so x comma y or say a comma b you can say which will just say check if a is less than b this will pair it will send true otherwise it will be false and great greater uh, lambda uh, a comma b this will again it will check a greater than b so if a is greater than b it will send true or false now we'll write our different my min max okay so the, now the, the test function or the our function will be the less the less say for greater of that is going to be going to pass here and we also need to collect all the comparison and uh, tuple right all the rest of the items we want to compare and we do the same idea as maybe you know uh, first equal to k0 we have to do the comparison so for item in k to the rest right uh, item in uh, rest of the k so if if function right and i say item item less than you know the item comma fr so it can be the function can be less f or greater f so if if it is item is less than fr for example it can be less than or you know either one the function can be either of that in either case what we have to do is fr the first one equal to item which means if f1 is less f so i it will compare item is less than fr if it is true it will make the first one item in our and, and same and, and same in the other case too so the basic idea is that we are keeping the greater or the less one at the in fr so return fr so now let us try it out my min max right and i can say maybe less f and i'm going to pass all my items one two So it is getting it is working for the uh, minimum value let's do great f right so it is working for the large value too so these are some of the examples um to to illustrate and also you could practice how to use arbitrary number of arguments in the function uh, call and how to pack them into a tuple and use inside a function some practical examples you could use and uh, now these uh, examples are taken from the book uh, uh, learning python by mark lutz and uh, he's my python guru and all the python i have learned is i learned from him and thanks to him Thank you very much for watching.